hi guys welcome back to my channel so today we're gonna do a get ready with me sorry my hair is all messed up i straightened it yesterday but as soon as i wake up my hair starts getting wavy again so it was like pointless to straighten it to be honest but and when i walk you know my hair ends up getting very um wavy and i don't know i need a haircut even though my hair is getting long say hi so I'm gonna play some mana, some music, and hopefully you can hear it because my phone, the noise, the the audio has been in and out. So sorry about that, guys. Um, so I'm gonna show you what I'm doing today. So today, let me see, maybe the music. I'll turn it down. But I'm gonna start off with primer, and I'm gonna use this one from One Stefani. And I got it for $8 at TJ Maxx. So, mama, eat your noodles, baby. So, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna come, oh, and then I'm wearing my earrings that I got at Burlington. But they were kind of hard to put on. Like, I felt like they were gonna break. So I gotta be careful because these were $8 and I never spent $8 on jewelry. But look how cool they look. Yeah, so hopefully I don't get a makeup on them. Maybe I'll take them off for now and then put them on at the end so I don't get makeup. Yeah, they look just something different. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with the serum. And this serum feels so so nice on the skin, and you don't need a lot because it's like. A lot of it comes like this. I don't know, but look at that glow, and it does smell so good. It just automatically makes my skin look feel so much better because it's so dry. But when you apply this, it gives you like that moisture that you needed and glow. See how it, it leaves a lot still in there, so I just apply it all over my arms. But yeah, this goes a long way. Can't see, but it gives you that pretty glow. So yeah, this is the primer I use, and then I go with my L'Oreal True Match Lumi Lotion. And ah, I just put like a line there, a line here. here. Okay. And then this I just spread it with my hands or my fingers. And ah, I put a lot on my nose. And I dark, got it in the darkest shade. Because I felt like the other ones were too light where I couldn't use them as highlighters and I wanted something that I could apply all over my skin. And that's why I have a mirror right here. I went with the darkest one. And as, as you can see, kind of does give me like a dark shadow, kind of like a dark color, but everything works out once I blend everything together. And I just realized that I forgot, oh no, I have to bring my... I forgot I took a few brushes, but I'll get them once it's time to get them. But yeah, this makes your skin so soft. The only thing I'm not crazy about the scent. Okay. Sorry, my husband and my niece are talking. Okay, so this is the Physicians Formula Butter Glow Liquid Bronzer. And I got it in bronze. I think they only have two shades. I don't know if that's all they have because I only saw the really light one for like highlight or this one for bronzing. But I use it as like a BB cream, like I said in my past video. Ah, I forgot this one. I don't apply. I don't blend it with the sponge. So as you can see, it gives you some color. You gotta be careful because. Uh, let me just turn off the music because much noise but as you can see it gives you more of a color 
It gives you such a pretty, pretty glow. Okay, so for this, I'll use it like an elf brush, but I don't think I'll use it. Does I have two of them? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I'll use this one. And I'll just start blending it with this brush. It just kind of evens out your your um, tone, your color, but it doesn't really cover like the pimple acne that much. Well, I mean, it does a little bit, but you'll still be able to see it through, like picking through. Mama! Thank you. The yeah, the boys are at school. I just have my niece and my husband's about to go to work. Yes, he does. And it's just me and my niece. It's so much fun. It kind of gives me like a dark shade compared to my neck, but then it matches my arms. I don't know how to explain it because I have like three different shades now. Like you're walking in the heat. She loves her uncle. She's getting water for the dog. Okay, so yeah, once everything's blended, then I go with um, concealer, and the one that I use first. If I didn't think of, oh yeah, I'm gonna go with the Sephora Biscuit Ever Full Coverage Concealer, and I have it. Hold on, I need to turn the light up. Can you guys turn up the light? Yes. Can you turn off the light, Mama? Mama, can you turn off the light? The flare. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Turn off the controller. I keep dropping my controller and then my husband complains why it's broken. Okay, so I think I might just use this shade. I might just do a little bit just to brighten a little bit because it does look kind of dark. You got your water that I put yeah. in there? Yeah, thank you, my love, for the advice. Uh, it's too late. Oh, oh you need to get it. Bye, Mia. Have fun. We'll see you guys later. Thanks. Okay, so like this. have been so bad guys i got my period last night and i kept waking up in so much pain like i had the worst cramps like i get bad cramps but um recently it was so much worse like all last night this morning is a little better but i can still feel them that's why i'm like oh you know <laughs> so i'm like i want my husband to go to work now because i don't know when i'm on my period like not to be mean, but he gets on my nerves. Like, I try to be patient, but, like, he annoys me, like, because I got new curtains that my friend gave me, and they're the off-white, and I'm like, make sure the dog does not go by there because our dog is so dirty. She tries to eat everything, and the first thing he lets, lets her go over there. I tell him, don't touch this, please, don't touch this. And then the first thing he touches the curtains, and you know they're off white, so I'm trying to keep them clean. They were gifted to me, you know, I want to take care of my stuff. And then um, I have put um, a glass table over there, but now it has like this, um, I covered it with something because he broke the glass. Like he is so clumsy. It was in the middle, right now it's in the corner, but it was in the middle and he still, because the glass is a little longer than the, the actual thing, and he shattered the whole glass. And now I don't have 
glass table now it's just there with nothing and i don't know he's just so so clumsy and i was trying to make our home look nicer and it seems like every time he messes something up it's like i can't have nothing nice like he's worse than the kids like he will break something before the kids break something he's just the most clumsiest person i know i used to think i was clumsy no my husband beats that like clumsier than anybody i've ever met and I got home and from the heat like it didn't really melt my makeup it just looked extra glowy but it didn't remove any of my makeup which I was so happy about Halo Glow Liquid Filter and I got a very dark shade to use it as liquid bronzer. make your skin look so healthy and I feel like when I do my makeup glowy like it makes me look younger because I mean I already look young for my age but I feel like lately I've been oh I got it all over my face I've been looking so much older with my canas with my gray hair but I noticed that when I do like a very dewy makeup light makeup I look so much fresher um, healthier, younger. Mm, I've been obsessed with this lately. You know, I used to be a very, very cool coverage, super matte. Like, I mean, I still like matte makeup, but like, I don't go for like the full, full coverage anymore. I mean, only for like special occasions, like when you really need your makeup, like to be nice all, all, all day long. But this one will last too, but it's just will be more glowy at the end of the day, like extra glowy. Okay, so after that, then I go with, I'll start setting uh, everything. So first, face first and then under the eye. No, first under the eye. So I'm going to go with my NARS um, Cove Press Powder, but it's so broken. I don't even want to show it, but there's like nothing there to be honest. So I'm just going to use some of the stuff, some of it that it's left. And I think I'm going to go back to using Essence Press Powder because those are only like $6 and they're so good. It's like as good as this. Yesterday I didn't lose um, use loose powder, so today I'm not gonna use loose powder. So I tend to get it all over my lashes when I use loose powder, translucent loose powder. So I'm not using that today. So she just said everything, so it kind of keeps it in there. I use the Makeup Forever uh, Professional HD Skin Matte Velvet Foundation Powder. So it's a foundation, but I don't apply a lot. 
and I don't know about the shade. I feel like it, the undertone is not the right one, but it sets my makeup, and this is where I put out the brush. I'll be right back. I'm going to try to be as fast as I can because I can't pause and edit, okay? Give me a second. Okay, I'm back. I'm going to use this this powder. I'm going to leave it and then lightly everywhere I'm gonna use is just one tap like that and then I'm gonna go with the Patrick Todd um, she's bronze and I'm only gonna use the powder like I did yesterday And I like this one because it's more of a natural blonde. And for this kind of look, this is perfect. I was so happy that my husband was able to take the boys this morning. So me and my niece didn't have to walk in this heat afternoon. Even though today is more, it's only in the 90s. Because yesterday and the day before, it was in the 100 plus. Yesterday wasn't honestly it wasn't too bad because there was some breeze. When there's breeze, it makes a big difference, you know. When it's humid and there's no air, it's like I can't breathe. I'm getting so closer. It's so it's so flawless. It's so healthy looking. I love it. Okay, so now I'm gonna go with another Patrick Talk. Duo, and this is the Sisoa Lace. I'm only going to use the powder blush instead of the liquid. This is just kind of like, it's very similar to that one, but this is more like terracotta, or what is that word? Like reddish brown. And then this little pin in this, you got to be careful. Think of anything because I don't know how to really conquer my nose, but I just want to add some color. Okay, and I'm not gonna use eyeshadow because, like, um, I forgot to bring eyeshadow just for the under eyes, so under the eyes, I'll have to do that at the end. But what am I gonna use now? Oh, so now I'm gonna go with the shade. Low Scope Multi-Use Cream Highlighting Blush. So, it's what I used yesterday is in um, Bronze Glow. And it's a deep shade, but I, I don't know why I like it as a highlighter, even though it's highlighter blush. So, what I do, first I'm going to apply with my finger. And I'm going to apply where I would put my highlighter. and it does look harsh but once i applied uh, a powder highlighter which is lighter it kind of blends in and this is what it's a little more pleasing to it but it just gives me like a burnt kind of look very um bronzed okay and then that's when i'm gonna avoid this brush i like to use the LA Girl Shimmer Spray because it has shimmer and it has like a gold. It kind of puts some shine in here. I only put a little bit. And 
And then I'm going to use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Highlighter in Iced Out. And I've had this forever. And it broke on me a long time ago. That's the only thing with the Anastasia highlighters that always break on me. It's too soft. When I used to have Becca, they never would break on me like that. Okay, so then you see it's more of a light yellow gold. It makes it more like wet looking. And it makes it less harsh of like a bronze. But it still gives you that bronze. I'm obsessed with it. I just wish you can see it better on my on my phone. And then I just wish this isn't broken because it's so messy. really pretty in the sun okay then what do I do next I'm gonna do some of my uh, NYX clear gel on my lashes I mean my eyebrows lip liner in sugar and spice it's like a pinky nude or pinky mauvey sharpen it to make it some mascara under my lashes. drink your water okay mm -hmm. oh my gosh my eyes are burning I noticed that this this mascara always makes my eyes burn it makes my eyes super watery I need to get a new one Do the 
eyebrow, um, get the brush for the eyebrows and then I'll be done. And the perfume that I'm using today is this one from YSL Black Opium and it's the original one. As you can see, I'm like almost done with it. I wanna get another one, the one that is all covered. I think that's the intense, I don't know, cause I have so many flankers that I can never, oh, that I can never keep up with this, but this smells so good, delicious. I would recommend if you haven't tried it. Um, so weird because the one that i bought because i had the travel size first and for some reason the travel size one wouldn't last on me but this one does so i'm so confused but um but just give me a minute let me just go get um what is it called the brush to do my eyebrows and then we'll be done okay guys and then i gotta brush this hair but give me one minute shadow tube for under the eye so let's do that first so what i do i use a celestial times thunder and i get like the deepest reddish brown and i just apply that under the eye i want a little too thick right now but that's okay So my eyes don't look too like simple okay and now i'm gonna go with the pomade and i'm gonna use this brush that i should have um cleaned okay so i'm gonna look over here because i have a mirror over here So that's literally all I do. Like, I don't do much. I just give it basically color because, as you can see, look before and after. It makes a little difference. I don't really have a shape. I don't have that much eyebrows. They're so thin because when I was younger, I used to always um get my eyebrows waxed. My mom always would let us wax our eyebrows so young. I think it was like in middle school or high school. I think it was middle school. And I mean, I never had like a lot of eyebrows to begin with, but I feel like with time, they got thinner and thinner. My sisters, they have beautiful eyebrows. I mean, I, yeah, eyebrows. I wish I had. Okay, I kind of messed that one up, so I'm going to have to kind of go again. I didn't do this one like wrong. But oh well, this is all I'm gonna do to them. And that's pretty much it, guys. Let me show you in the lighting. Um, let me just do my earrings, but I feel like my hands are so like dirty from the, the product. But let me show you just real quick. And then I'll put my earrings at the end. Okay. This lighting maybe. But see how it gives you like a such a pretty glow and it's not like full coverage at all. It just gives you enough coverage where um it like blends your whole skin and um gives you that beautiful, beautiful glow. So it's kind of like what I was using yesterday. The only difference is the lip. But uh, next time I'll do that lip and I can do the look again. Um, Cause sometimes I switch it up, you know, sometimes I will use foundation. But yeah, but that's everything today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry, it's like a 30 minute video, but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I post a video. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.